Hello loves, welcome back to Colette's Corner and this video, <coughs> excuse me, it's going to be about my Ixtar contour pillow, this one, this big guy. <laughs> well, this was sent to me, um, the video is not sponsored, I'm not affiliated with the brand or anything. Um, and it's not a sponsored video, all right? I was not paid to review the pillow or anything of the sort. It was just sent to me for free for me to use it and see how I like it and give my truthful, honest opinion, okay? Now, that being said, and all the niceties out of the way, I like this pillow <laughs> I do I like the pillow um, it is a bit larger than my original pillow um, I'm going to link the unboxing video because I'm not gonna go over the other little nuances that I did with the unboxing because you know it's already videotaped so I will link that video if I can do it in the cards up top I will if not, I'll put it in the bottom so that you can just go to my other video and see the official unboxing of the, the pillow, right? So, <clears throat> I kept, I actually kept the box that it came in, but it's not necessary to show you guys the box again, right? <clears throat> Excuse me. But here I have the little instruction manual that came with it. So, it says Ixtar, I-K-S-T-A-R. Ixtar, Ixtar, I'm pronouncing it the way my little English speaking brain is telling me to. So, it's a double-sided contour memory foam pillow. That is how it is described. It has different sections, as you can see, not only on the picture, the picture, but the um, pillow itself. They have a Monday to Friday, 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. Pacific, Pacific Standard Time. And they have an email and an Amazon thing where you can reach the customer service, right? And support team. It tells you what the pillow is made of, what the case is made of. Um, it tells you how to care for the pillow and what not to do with the pillow. It tells you the height of the pillow, which one side is 5.3 inch, um, 16 one down this way, 25 inches across, and 4.2 on that side, right? So you get all of this good information when you unbox the pillow, you take it out of the box. Um, using your contour pillow, this is how it shows us. You have for side sleeper, for the back sleeper, and for the stomach sleeper. Now, I'm gonna tell you a little something about these side pillows, these um, contour pillows. Be being a side sleeper, I am a side sleeper, for the last few years, I've been practicing to sleep on my back. It doesn't always go that well. <laughs> so, with this pillow, it gives you the options. So, the higher side is for the, um, the side sleeper and the, the, the lower part is for the back sleeper. But anyway, it tells you. And then you have... Um, you have the two different heights, right? So one side of the pillow is higher than the other. So based on whether you're a side sleeper or a back sleeper, you choose. I use the lower part for the back. However, I'm going to tell you what happened with me in that. It has an 18-month warranty on it. Um, lifetime technical support. And of course, like I said, they have email and information is given here so you can reach out. Um, that's it, pretty much. That's the brunt of it. Um, you can get a 
additional pillowcases for it <clears throat> sorry and um, for me I um I use the regular pillowcase on it I have not taken off the pillowcase that comes on the unit itself but I'm funny that way I don't like to sleep on the bare um, case that comes on it because this is a pillowcase itself it can unsnap it unsnaps in the center and then you snap it back when you wash it so basically you can unzip it here's a zipper it can be unzipped and you unsnap that and throw this bit this part in the wash okay so this is the high side of the pillow this is the low side of the pillow I've been using the low side of the pillow because I sleep on my back but the trouble, and this is no fault to the pillow, this is me, this is me, this is a user thing, so don't walk away thinking that this is gonna happen to you. If you're a back sleeper, you shouldn't have a problem, because you'll stay on your back and you won't have any problems. Now me, I'm a side sleeper and I like to sleep on my left side, which is, doctors may tell you, it's better to sleep on your left side, right? It's been a habit of mine for years. I really love to, sleep, love to sleep on my left side. But I do have cervical issues in the lower part of my cervical spine. And I also have pinched nerves and disc degeneration and stuff going on. So I'm kind of special, okay? I'm always in pain, but I live my life. That being said, the only thing I've encountered using the pillow is when I'm on my back, I fall asleep like boom. The pillow is so comfortable. It just I just relax into the pillow, my head rests in there like that, and I'm I'm there. My head is in the pillow like that, right? And I'm my shoulders are perfectly aligned and I'll fall asleep in no time. The first two weeks of using the pillow no problem but here's what happened comfort in my sleep roll I'm on the left side and what happens when I get on my left side whether with this pillow or the other pillow I have or just any normal pillow but I don't use normal pillows once I start laying on this left side you know your trapezius muscle is right in here, right? So when you're on the left side and this side, get all that pressure and your weight is pretty much there, then I start having pain, goes back in the traps, the neck, then there's tingling down my arm again and the fingers and the whole nine yards, I'm in pain and sometimes the pain is so bad, it's like right here in my chest, not a good feeling. So that's the only problem that I encountered. And it's no fault of the pillow. It has nothing to do with the pillow. I have the same problem when I use the other contour pillow. I cannot go on my left side. But this pillow makes me so comfortable. It's easy for me to slip over onto that left side. And my head is still cradled. And I'm still sleeping and then I wake up I feel the cramping starting and then I wake up and I realize I'm on my left side <laughs> that was the only drawback but other than that I really like the pillow and I'm thinking how am I going to combat that because I need to stay I really actually need to stay on my back so if you are a solid back sleeper and you have neck neck pain neck issues and you will you will stay on your back you should have no problem with this pillow it's just like the other one only like i said this one is a little bit softer it's a little more squishy but it bounces back really nice and it really cradles you and make you feel so comfortable you will sleep on it and like me you probably want to turn around and put your face <clears throat> sorry put your face in the pillow i'm not a good tummy sleeper i've tried it it's not so good and 
being on the stomach is not good for you either because it's not just your breathing, it's your shoulder, your your midsection and your back. You can really hurt yourself being on a tummy sleeper all night. You know, there there are ways to combat that. You need to prop yourself properly and such. But um for you stomach sleepers, who knows? You might not have a problem. But there, it's really comfortable. It is re really a comfortable pillow. So I want to say again, thank you for Emily for sending this to me. Um, it is on Amazon and I will also link it below so you guys can have a link to the actual pillow and also the, um, the unboxing video so you guys can see. So yeah, I'm not going to lament there's nothing else really to talk about. <laughs> I like the pillow. Um, I just have to learn to stay on my back. Because when I stay on my back, I'm fine. But when I switch over, not so good. Then that's it. So that's that's the pillow again. So there it is. And it's not... I wouldn't travel with it. I've traveled with the other one. But... I guess if you had to, like, when I travel out of the country and I know I'm going to be gone for like a week or two weeks, then I took the other one with me because I ain't going to sleep on nobody's pillow and hurt up myself. I'm not doing it. So when I went to South America <laughs> back in 2019 and I think 2016, somewhere there, yeah, I took my pillow with me. And playing them games, honey. Right on the plane, walked it right on the plane in my hand. Just hugged it up like so. <laughs> and go with it. So the other thing that I, I was saying, um, this is a clean, fresh satin pillow I'm gonna put on her because I do change my pillowcases um sometimes more than once a week, depending on if I put makeup on and lay on the pillow on the bed um, taking a nap or something throughout the day um, or I just feel like changing the pillowcase because I'm weird like that sometimes once a week is usually good enough but sometimes I change the pillowcase more than once a week because I don't want to see any makeup residue or thing on my pillow like it's my face is my makeup but why Okay, so if you don't think I'm too weird and you understand all of that, then, you know, thank you for understanding, but it's just me. So I pulled off the, the case that was on it, and I'm just going to put this case on it, this pillowcase on, because, like I said, I make it a habit not to sleep on the outer casing that um, covers the pillow. Um, that's it. If you have any questions anything at all let me know i know some of you like the first pillow that i reviewed and you guys sometimes tell me that you ordered the pillow based on you know you ordered it from seeing my video um just like that pillow this one i'm gonna tell you the same thing like i said i'm not being compensated in any way shape or form so let me repeat that for the purpose of the video I am not sponsored, I am not affiliated, I am not nothing, okay? I'm not getting paid. I did, however, get it for free to use it and see if I like it. And I was on the market to get a second one anyway, so it came in just for me right on time because I had one that's similar to the one I already had in my cart. So when I was offered this one, I accepted it because I wanted to test it out for myself and see because I was going to buy a new one. So I don't need to buy a new one because I got this one gifted to me and I really like the pillow. So that's it. I am stuck with using these, I'm assuming, for the rest of my life. But that's it. So I will provide the link, as I said, or you can search for Ixtar on Amazon. We all know how to do those things, right? But I will provide the link below and um, I will.
will also let you know what's what's, what's that anyway <laughs> yeah I'll, I'll i'll link the unboxing and i'll link the actual product thing to amazon for you guys for those of us who just want to scroll down and click because i do that sometimes sometimes i get lazy and i i watch a video especially those tiktok made me buy videos i like when they have links <laughs> so i just scroll down and click yeah it's called laziness but <laughs> we all fall into the trap sometimes right anyway if you order that let me know but initially what i was gonna say just now without seeming like i'm rambling is that um i appreciate getting the pillow and thank you emily um i was on the market for a new pillow so this made me not have to buy a new one and um, i'm not being compensated once again so that you know that this is just me and the another reason for me mentioning this is that that video that you guys watch and tend to purchase the pillow i really felt the need at the time to make that video because when i checked on youtube nobody had an actual user video that was geared towards that type of pillow do you understand what i'm saying so when i bought it took a chance and i bought it and i tried it and i liked it i said you know what let me do the video and there was this one disrespectful human who had something to comment bad about the color of my lipstick and i pretty much told her you're an idiot and deleted and blocked her because what that have to what the color of my lipstick had to do with the vi the, the actual pillow the actual video nothing anyway so that being said i appreciate you guys i know that you guys are enjoying these types of videos from me because i notice the views on them so i will try to share more of that content with you guys if that's what you want to see but bless your hearts i really appreciate it um if i like something i like it and i like to hear when people like something honestly and they give you their honest viewpoint about it and they don't act like oh because i was sent this or because i was i'm being paid for it then they kind of sugarcoat stuff and throw it at you no i don't deal with the sugarcoating nonsense okay and those of you who've been around me long enough you know this i do not sugarcoat the nonsense i can't it's not within me i just say it like it is and it's out there so thank you again thank you so much for watching and if you're in market for one of those pillows go ahead and check it out check it out man check it out because it's a good pillow ikstar contour pillow all right take care and once again emily thank you so much for gifting the pillow to me i absolutely love it and i'm going to learn to stay on my back <laughs> so i don't hurt up myself but thank you all right take care enough love stay well and on to the next video walk good bye bye